inspiration, and certainly the uh, the uh, you know the all corn uh, game was uh, was uh, good as well. Um, I thought we got some things done there. Um, so uh, you know we're going to go play a good Missouri team that's all, that's you know uh, playing well right now, and uh, we're uh, excited about that opportunity and and. Uh, you know, just having watched their their series at Kentucky, they're they're a really solid club and can do a lot of things well. So, hopefully, uh, hopefully go out there and play well because you know this is a time of year where you, you need to start playing playing well. What have you seen from your team this week? Kind of responded from from last weekend. Yeah, I think um, you know just a little more electricity in our feet, a little bit you know a lot more hustle type things, things that. You, know, you might not necessarily notice unless you're really paying close attention. Um, um, I, I, I think again, just just an overall awareness of every pitch instead of uh, you know trying to hope things are going to go your way because you had a great year last year. Um, you, you don't hope. You go out there and you, you make it happen. You make one pitch adjustments at the plate and on the mound, and you communicate and you bust it on and off the field. You get to first base the right way. So I think all of that stuff is is a little bit better. You know, I just I think we went through a little bit of a lull, and of course, as I mentioned several times, it's my responsibility. And I think I think we uh, together has have uh, you know captured the essence of some of the things that we need to do better. N none of those things necessarily guarantee victory. Um, but you go to sleep at night knowing that you did everything you possibly could to, you know, to win a baseball game. So uh, yeah, that's important. Butch, Butch said the other night that he doesn't expect Preston back this weekend. Yeah, I don't think Preston will be able to uh, pitch again. Hopefully, he can rehab to the extent to where, you know, maybe we can get him back uh, later on in the season. But yeah, that's that's a tough blow to our pitching staff because those guys are pitching well. Um, you know, we've lost several guys, all different things, and all. You know, uncontrollable. It's just, you know, one of those things that, that has happened. So, uh, you know, we got to make the best of it. Every team has injuries, you know, so that's not an excuse. But, you know, when it's to your pitching staff, you feel like that's strength of your club. I think, you know, that, that's going to affect us a little bit different than other other people. So, uh, but, yeah, I, I'm, you know, we need some guys to step up. And, you know, anytime a door closes on one player, another door should open for another. And hopefully, uh, you know, that's what will happen. Why do you like Trevor on Friday and maybe Ross on Saturday? You know, it's a series of things. Number one, um, it, it, it really depends on how much rest they've had. Ross has really operated well on Saturdays for a variety of reasons. Um, I think hitters are a little different on Friday night than they are on Saturday. I think that uh, um, Ross is definitely a, a creature of habit. I'm not saying he can't pitch well on a Friday, but I am going to say that you know, moving moving him up was probably something that I, I really fought and did not want to do. Um, he really, I think, on Saturday makes the Sunday guy behind him better in a lot of ways. Um, so I, you know, I, I feel like he's had a lot of success on Saturdays, and um, so hopefully we'll get him right back on track with that. If you 